These traps consist of two elements. A permeable and porous rock tank called a reservoir that is soaked with water and an impermeable rock that has a dome-shaped cover, in most cases made of clay. If one of these traps is on the upward path of the hydrocarbons, they begin to accumulate. An accumulation that is big enough to be exploited economically is called a field. A field of hydrocarbons is not an underground lake inside a rock cavity, but a rock with pores containing fractions of gas, oil, and water. Gas which is the lightest is found in the upper part of the field. Lower down there is oil, sometimes mixed with gas, and lower still, water. When the oil is extracted, the structure of the rock is not altered, and the water in the field replaces the oil that has been withdrawn. The size of a field depends on the dimensions of the traps and the rock tanks, and can vary from a few to tens of kilometers. Original reserves vary from more than 11 billion tons in the Gawar field in Saudi Arabia to a few hundred for smaller fields.